All right, let's take a look at an absolute classic today. The song Smoke on the Water by Deep Purple. Doesn't get more classic than that. Drums by the left-handed legend Ian Pace. And Ian is playing 16th notes on the hi-hat. One E under, two E under, three E under, four E under. Played right, left, right, left, right, left. One E under, two E under, three E under, four E under. One E under, two. And what he's doing is he's accenting the first of every four notes on the downbeats of one, two, three, and four. So we're playing loud, 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 loud. And then this is, a, this is a, an interesting fill, interesting choice. It's three E and, right, left, right. And the bass drum plays the uh. Three E and uh, which then gives the hands time to move to the snare and crash on beat four. Three E and a uh, four. Three E and a uh, four. And that snare drum's kind of played a little bit quieter than the two tom notes. Lovely. Uh, very, very subtle. If you don't understand the difference between straight and strung, then straight, straight and swung, then don't beat yourself up about it. Yeah. Six stroke roll is a common hybrid rudiment um, that is played right, left, left, right, right, left. The first note's accented and the last left hand accent note is accented as well. And the doubles in between are played quietly. Right, left, left, right, right, left. And you can loop it. Really useful um, lick to learn because it has loads of uses. Really cool little lick. Love that drum for that is awesome. You know, you could play lots of different ways you could play the same diddle 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 it. Uh, and, and make it sound kind of the same. Um, so don't worry if, if you forget which toms to use for that drum fill in that particular part of the song. Use whatever toms you like, no one's really gonna hear the difference. 